Okay, so we've got the grav lift elevator sheet, which actually has also got all of these, you know, the, the majority of the rest of these um, uh, railings to go on there, and it's got the stairs on it as well. Okay, so um, let's just pop this out. Pretty simple, there's your railings, we won't talk about those. Okay, first of all the elevator then. Now again, you've got um, some areas to pop out here. You've got a couple of options. You can um, you can assemble it with the big base or and, and have one elevator that holds up to six minis with 25 millimeter bases. Um, or you can have the small elevators uh, a la the original sci-fi set, which is just holds two. Okay, so first things first, we're gonna keep the pressure on right here. Um, we've got some half cuts here, but they're quite strong half cuts uh, for this because we want a little bit of strength on this. Okay, so and because there's a, 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 a hole here, you have to really put the pressure on on this part here to keep that in nice and tight. Okay, so there's one, and I'm going to do the same on this one as well, keeping the pressure right in there. Do, 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 do. There we go, so a couple of bits. And all we need to do is actually just slot that onto here. There's one. This is really nice actually. Beautiful, no, no adjustments or anything. Okay, and there you go, there is your, your lovely your lovely lift as it were. You can fit, like I say, six miniatures in there. Now, that's one choice you can have, um, or you can basically assemble it into two smaller ones, which I'll uh, just show you very quickly. Okay, because you've got two of those. Like so. And you can have the, the, the smaller lifts as well. Okay, so that's really, really cool. Um, let me grab some of those. Okay, now, in order to get the lifts to work, and I'll demo it on the big one. In order to get the lift to, to kind of go to various levels, what you need is you need this little clip sheet here, uh, E, for those of you, okay. Uh, they've actually got the, uh, the, the giraffe clips on them, okay, because they look like little giraffes. Okay, um, and you've got, uh, you'll need a pair of them to activate, and there's uh, there's eight there, so that's four pairs. Okay, so if you can imagine, we've got a lift here, uh, and you want to get a lift up to this bit just here, okay? Um, there's no way of really holding it there, and that's where those clips come in. Um, so what you do is you actually remove that floor there, okay? And you're going to put the giraffe clips just here, okay? And they're going to go into the the bottom or the top, sorry, of the of the wall below. So I'm going to pop those in there, like so. Push that down a bit. There we go. Okay, um, and you'll see that they actually just sit just in front of the wall, and you can give them a bit of a tweak like that. Okay, so what happens is when it's time for you to travel with your guys up to the next level, you can literally just hook them on there and the lift sits in in that level and then you can do it for another level and another level. And having them clipped to the bottom wall means that you can still have this floor removed to allow you to get in here without having to kind of, you know, you can still have, um, you know, you don't have to lift up a whole section with a load of minis on it or anything like that. Um, it keeps it nice and simple for you. Okay, and of course that works exactly the same if you've got the smaller lift as well. Okay, and the beauty of that is you can go up and down, you can go left and right from one building to another, which is really, really cool. Um, so um, so that's that. Now, if you're, if you're going to have big lifts and you're not using your smaller ones here, um, there's a couple of things you can do. You can, for a start, you can slot them together um, like that, and you can have these little barricades, which are really, really cool. Um, you can have it like that, or you could um, put uh, a clip on it, like so and you can have a barrier like that as well. Um, 
and uh, just uses one clip, the whole thing stands up fine. You could obviously add, add, add another one on there if you wanted to as well. You can do all sorts of things. You could then clip that onto the, you know, onto part of the building if you wanted to or do whatever. So I don't know, you know, there's probably a lot of options you can do there, but you've got, you've got these things here as well um, that you can just mess around with and have some fun. Don't know what that is. Okay. Um, <clears throat> Last but not least then, we've got the stairs. So, um, let's have a look. Uh, again, stairs have got lots of little areas here. You can decide to have them opaque or you can have the railings, which is obviously, you know, look through, which is my preferred uh, thing. Okay, so with the stairs, you've got two side rails. And then you've got five of the main steps, and then you've got this top step. This is a new design based on what we learned from the shanty town, okay, and how those steps and stairs work. So first of all, I'm just going to very carefully um, pop in the runs, and they go they go in this way backwards, as it were, um, which is really cool. Okay, when you've got one side in. <clears throat> You will then very, very carefully, it just takes a little bit of uh, time to get used to, very, very carefully, don't try and slot anything in straight away, just gently and carefully move it to the right position and start lining up all the slots. Um, and then when you're there, um, you just gently start easing everything in. Okay, and there you have it. You've got this little set of stairs. Right at the very top, <coughs> You've actually got an area here um, where you can put this new, um, this kind of new clip. Now, before we put that in, if you're connecting, you can use this just to connect into um, floors, anywhere you like, really. Okay, and that works perfectly well to get you up to the next level. Okay, um, and that's always worked well. Now, the issue comes is when this connects to a floor on a level where you need to lift that up, the stairs go with it. So, what you do. If that's the case, okay, so we don't want the stairs to go up with, with, you know, a building as it were, we want it to stay at the base. So we can put this extra step on the top, like so, and we use a L clip, and we use that to clip it to the floor below, and that really leaves it in perfect condition there, and then that way, if you've got a building here that you want to walk up to but you want to get underneath, you can lift that off without having to take the stairs and the minis and everything else with it uh, at the same time. So that's the uh, stair design that you can use in two different ways, basically. Pop that over there. And that is the grab lift and elevator sheet.